Okay, Callaway Golf went off and, and they dropped three brand new golf balls on me. We got Chrome Soft, the red box, Chrome Soft X, the black box, and Chrome Soft X LS, the silver box. But I'm gonna show you guys how I test golf balls. There's a lot to unpack here. So we're gonna hit some putts, we're gonna hit some chips, we're gonna hit some bunker shots, few irons, few drivers to find out what Chrome Soft golf ball will work for you. And uh, I'm a little curious what Chrome Soft golf ball will work for me. Let's do a deep dive. Here we go. Welcome to the world of wonder. Let the games begin. Oh, this thing's awesome. It's actually a lot of fun to hit. This is Mr. Phil Mickelson. Phil, it's nice to meet you. I know a lot about your bag. How much do you know about your own? Not as much as you. Hey, that's a good reason to put an iron in your bag. There's so much that goes into it just in the golf club. Did you see that? Okay, when I'm testing golf balls, the first thing that I do is I come to a putting green. Sound is feel. I just want to see what these sound like. The reason why you want to work from the green backwards when you're testing golf balls is because most of the shots that you play are around the green. So it's got to hold up around the greens. Then you go to your irons and then you go to the driver. And the driver, typically, you're only hitting 12 to 14 shots with the big stick with the golf ball. So when you're testing golf balls, you always want to work from the green back to the tee. I got Chrome Soft here, Chrome Soft X in the middle. And the one I'm really curious about, Chrome Soft XLS. Now, the Chrome Soft doesn't have a four-piece construction like the other two do, but they all have the Tour Arrow cover. I don't even care if these balls go in the hole. I'm literally just listening. And there's one ball I'm really curious to see what it sounds like, and that's the LS, because that one had a little bit of a harder cover before. So let's just see what they sound like. The first one, Chrome Soft, really soft, Chrome Soft. Okay, now we're gonna go to Chrome Soft X. Okay, this is the one I'm actually really excited to hit. It's got a new cover. The last one was a little clicky for my ears. And it sounds exactly like Chrome Soft X. So it checks off an entirely new box for me. But now we're gonna go hit some pitch shots. Okay, the next level testing golf balls is just hitting some shots around the green. So I have all three balls lined up here. And what I like to do there's a couple different shots I like to hit. So the first ball I'm gonna try is Chrome Soft. So what I'm expecting from this is spin, but not like crazy, crazy rip spin. Let's just see what they do. That wasn't bad. Okay, now we're gonna go to Chrome Soft X. So what I'm expecting out of this one is a little bit lower window with a little bit more spin. Like you could hear that one grab. Okay, so that's Chrome Soft Deck. So that ball did exactly what I thought it was gonna do. The only difference from what I'm told from R&D is it's faster pro on average off the tee. Okay, Chrome Soft XLS. I'm more curious here on how it feels off of the face. The last one, like I said, was a little clicky, the last LS. And when I say clicky, it just had a harder cover on it. There's a good one. Xander told me that he likes this because it does fly out of a little higher window. Once again, it flies out of a little higher window, but it's pretty soft. So what I'm noticing is that it does play a little softer than last year. And boom. So the three balls on this shot, Chrome Soft comes out a little higher with a little less spin. Chrome Soft X came out a little lower with more spin. Chrome Soft XLS flies out of a little higher window. It's a lot softer off the face got more of a Chrome Soft X feel. So now we're gonna go to the bunker. And all I'm looking for here is just pure spin. I wanna see how they react in the air, how they check up. We're gonna start with the red box Chrome Soft, go into this little short flag right here. It tends to come out a little higher, a little softer with a little less spin. It still checks up. So now we're gonna to go to Chrome Soft X. So Chrome Soft X around the greens, so far even with the chip, the pitch shots and these shots, it's a really consistent ball. It's got a ton of spin, it retains its spin. So now we're gonna try the Chrome Soft X LS. I'm kind of in love with this golf ball right now. Dude, that was filthy. Chrome Soft X is in trouble. I love the way Chrome Soft X LS 
is spinning around the greens. I didn't have it before and I have it now, which potentially makes this the greatest golf ball that Callaway's ever made. Let's go to the driving range and take some full rips. Okay, in an effort to work from the green backwards to test golf balls, now we are on the practice tee. Uh, the way I do it, I hit seven irons and then I hit drivers. Middle ground of the bag, obviously the big stick matters. So now we're just gonna hit seven irons with each, each ball. And I'm looking for launch and spin. Got Chrome Soft, red box first. And let's see what happens. Launch is a little higher than my normal seven irons do. It's that launched at 19. 6,300 on the spin on that one. And this ball at higher speeds is actually, because of its low spin nature, it's actually kind of a forgiving golf ball. That was about probably 15 feet higher than I normally hit it. Okay, so that ball did exactly what I thought it was gonna do. It's just, a, it just goes straight. So now let's hit the Chrome Soft X. It's launching three degrees lower with every shot. That's ex those, are the, those are gamer numbers to me. 17-1 launch, I guarantee this is over 7,000 spin. 71-11 spin. 168 carry, 171 total. That's a seven iron for me. Okay, so now we're gonna get to the Chrome Soft X LS. Now in a perfect world for me, this ball will go a little bit further, a little bit higher, with just a couple R RPMs less of spin than Chrome Soft X. If it does, Chrome Soft X could be done. The relationship could be over. There we go. Oh yeah. This is the ball that's gonna separate everybody. We'll have non-staffers in this ball. For that reason, look at that thing fly. 6,900 spin. It's nice making new friends. I just made a new friend today. Let's go hit some drivers. Okay, so the last test is the driver. So we're gonna start with a Chrome Soft. What I'm expecting out of this ball is it for it to launch a little higher, a little less spin, and I'm actually expecting it to hold this line. But now, my swing speed, I'm about 107, 108. I'm 45 years old. I don't move it like I used to. Fall speed anywhere between 158 and 162. So I'm a little harder at that one and just mashed it. So the reason why these go a little higher is because people in the higher handicap range need to get the ball up. So that's why it's kind of a self-correcting golf ball. 160 ball speed, 14.7 launch at 23.80 spin. Now let's go to Chrome Soft X. What I'm expecting out of this is exactly what I expect out of the golf ball I play, which is this one. If I hit it out of the nuts, I should, it should be about 161 ball speed, 2200, uh, 2200 spin, and about 13 or 14 launch. Ooh. 165 ball speed, 14-4 launch at 23-12 spin. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, last one. I think she heard, Chrome Soft X heard that LS was, was making a play for the bag. And I think they had a little, a little team meeting. Okay, now we're on to Chrome Soft X LS. I'm expecting this to launch higher, less spin, and maybe go further. That was mashed. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm hitting numbers I haven't hit in a long time. 166 ball speed at 13 launch and 2180 spin. I would bottle that up right now for the rest of my life and be super happy. Ugh. As hard as I can swing, I didn't catch that one. 161 ball speed at 14 launch and 2400 spin. Good numbers, and I miss hit that. Okay, that's a lot to unpack in that ball test. But you see how we work from the green back. So I was able to confirm that the Chrome Soft XLS is my new ball and it's a better one for me based on this whole test. I knew it was good with the putter, I liked how it sounded. I knew it was good around the greens, I liked how it spun. I loved it off the irons and I really love it off of the driver. But if you're wondering what golf ball is right for you, I'll break it down for you quickly. Chrome Soft, the red box, is for your low to mid handicapper, maybe even your higher handicapper looking for a little bit more ball speed, a little higher launch, and a little bit more forgiveness. Remember, it's a softer compression golf ball, so it just doesn't spin as much. Then you go into Chrome Soft X, which is your tour performance golf ball played by Phil Mickelson and John Rahm. It spins, it's fast, it's a little bit lower launching, and it's probably our most responsive golf ball that we make. And we all saw what Chrome Soft X LS can do, which is my new golf ball.
all three balls come in uh, white, white with triple track, and yellow with triple track. And of course, the Chrome Soft come with the ever popular Truvis. Uh, any more information for you, go to CallawayGolf.com, World of Wonder website. We're going to be doing some deep dives on the ball. I hope you guys enjoyed that test. Chrome Soft XLS, welcome to the Wonder Bag. I'm glad to have you. We're out of here.